Yo, what's up guys? So we have some new Yu-Gi-Oh cards to check out. We got a new like dark version of Luna and then on top of that we've got new DD support or it's basically for a bunch of cards that would be more so a banish archetype. Uh, but anyways, let's go ahead and hop right into it. So the first card that we're going to go ahead and check out is Luna the Dark Spirit, which is of course this artwork. And I love the artwork. Probably getting changed in the TCG Kappa. But anyways, it's 1600 attack, 1200 defense, level 4, uh, dark. And uh, anyways, it uh, cannot be normal summoned or set, and it uh, must first be special summoned from your hand by banishing a dark monster from your graveyard, which is interesting. It will work with the next card that we're going to be talking about, but then once per turn during your standby phase, you get to inflict 500 damage to your opponent. I mean, that that really is kind of irrelevant. Uh, I mean, you could technically use it as a combo extender for... Uh, certain decks, but I think the white and black dragons would be overall much better because you can recycle and go for other things But uh, technically uh, it is a dark fiend so it could have other synergy But it basically has synergy with the other card which is the DD patrol plane Which is uh, this card over here. So this card is a uh, level 3 dark with 1200 attack 800 defense points and it is a dark machine monster and it says you can only use the effect of this card's name once per turn and that first effect is during the end phase of a turn in which this card was banished you get to banish one card in your hand or on your side of the field or in your graveyard uh, and if you do you get to special summon this card in attack position which is generally not so great the uh scout plane is not what i would consider ideal anyways um actually you know what let's go to scout plane i mean i guess like the idea um is to maybe utilize both of them uh the, the artwork you can definitely tell it is kind of like in the same family here uh but anyways just a once per turn during the uh, end phase of this card is currently banished and was banished by uh, this turn you get to special summon and face up attacks and it's not too good to leave some stuff there but obviously if there's other cards i'm not, not saying exactly enemy controller but i'm saying like cards like enemy controller where you can like tribute your card to do something else there might be some interesting other interactions um i'm not sure if you can play that like as like a pure like deck itself uh meaning that like you just utilize just like those cards you probably have to mix it in something uh at the moment like if we go to even like macro uh macro and d fishers they're all at one anyway so it's going to be a lot more difficult to really utilize this card um, as well as the other card because again those are kind of required you can maybe mix it in metaphys it's not too bad obviously the d, d rulers are gone here uh, but just any effects where like if you would banish you'd get an effect I'm not sure if I would consider it great in a giant rex deck uh, or well most were dinosaurs uh, as a splashable thing I've seen a lot of random uh, tech to throw in giant rex and then uh, obviously you can just banish it but the problem that I have with uh, the newer card is it's just too slow I mean going back to it um, this card over here it uh, during the end phase if it was able to like you know if this card is banished you can banish another card in your hand then the card would open up the doors to a lot more plays but again it looks like we're getting more support for uh that nonetheless and there are other cards and i'm, I'm assuming people will be uh, trying to mix it in necro face because sometimes uh, early on in the game if you draw this card it doesn't really have any cards to shuffle in so you can kind of be dead but i guess it is another allure of darkness target so you can allure the card and then you can get rid of necro face and then get a lot of cards for maybe grand mod or Diiza. so i guess at the end of the day it could be utilized for that but it also just banishes one card so these are i mean technically ascension over here would just be another card um but most of the time it's usually like, like banish one monster or something like that uh, but it does give you those options but again i don't see anything too insane uh with the card itself i mean you get most of the thunder dragons effects via their own effects anyways like it's, it's just kind of unnecessary uh but nonetheless uh i just figured i mentioned some other potential combos but anyways uh guys let me know your thoughts on the dd patrol plane is there a good use of this card or luna uh in any other thing like i said if you're looking at more of a combo extension there are much better options like destroy because in that case it's a tuner um and also it's much easier to summon uh but again you get that extra 500 damage which again i think is going to be mostly irrelevant um because it's during your standby phase so you'd have to summon it and then wait but again uh if this was a quick effect then we're looking at something again a lot better unfortunately um it's just during the end phase though so there might be options to, you know, just banish it during, uh, I mean, technically, you could just, if you happen to have D-Fish or Macro, just let it go away. Just set this card, dies, okay, in phase, okay, go ahead and banish another card. And then you could re-special summon it, so it can kind of reoccur, kind of like, uh, Trueborn Frog, maybe, but again, it's just too slow. Anyways, I feel like I'm ranting on longer than necessary here. Uh, you guys get the idea. It's just too slow, but again, 
maybe someone's gonna figure out a combo but anyways let me know your thoughts on either of these cards down below but anyways thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed the video if you did drop a like on it and if you're new here you want to see more new Yu -Oh cards as soon as they get announced hit that subscribe button turn on the bell and it'll definitely be notified and if you guys got any replays of either one of these uh as a crazy combo would love to see it but anyways thanks for watching guys peace out and i'm out